Ketchup was telling us in the in our, our little group of friends. Right. Ketchup did get top three at a hat a couple of weeks ago, so perhaps looking for a repeat performance with the character, but I guess technically not the same character. This is Iggy, but... Mm -hmm. Up oh, bears into bear, just getting a quick 63%. What is the damage output on this character is kind of insane. Absolutely. But already Ooh. looking for an early combo. Ooh, he thought he was going to roll in. Neo throwing out as many uh, Hadoukens as possible. There's a dare trying to put as much, uh, trying to put some shield pressure on Shine. Yeah, but the Mecha Koopa comes out this time. That will put stage pressure mm -hmm. onto Nito. Down tilt. Yeah. Oh, trying to get a trying to get a roll read. But um, one of the things Ken does have a really hard time against ca characters that have like really good setups because most of these setup characters like Pac-Man, um, Bowser Jr., Duck Hunt Dog, they command the neutral, and that's oh man he. Gimped him off that dare. Yeah, excellent work. Just goes for a couple of dares in a row, and Iggy looking like Iggy Azalea at the moment because that was fancy. Yeah. and But, like, as I was saying before, uh, Ken has a really hard time against these kind of setup characters because they command the neutral. And Ken really needs to find that way in, and it's going to be very hard with all these lingering projectiles in the way. All of a sudden, three stocks to play with and a percent lead. Shine absolutely flying here. Yeah, trying to get the confirm with uh, the cart into up B. Oh, the but... Up smash will lead to a three stock for Shine. What a great game won, and with an unorthodox character, <laughs> nothing unorthodox about that victory, though. Uh-huh. Yeah, um, he kind of played around the focus. He hit him with the clown cart once, realized uh, Nito wasn't throwing, wasn't uh, letting go. And so he threw out the multi-hit up smash to catch it. Right, that up smash so good for reading inward rolls, and you know, as is most characters' up smashes. But Bowser Jr.'s has such a wide hitbox on stage; mm -hmm. it's not good for anti-airing as much as you think it might be. But if you catch someone on stage, and now we're going to see the fox from Shine. Are we? We are. Yeah. This one's different. I would have. I would not have expected him to do this one. <laughs> I mean, it's Shine. What are you expecting? I, I'm expecting a lot, but I'm not expecting Fox because usually Foxes hate this matchup. <laughs> Foxes combo food. Look at this. Now that now um, Nito's getting all this type of pressure in, and, and the oh, there's there. no. He is too low to make. He is not too low to make it back. Mm -mm. No, Fox's recovery is uh, very long. It is. But now Shine now has to actually deal with uh, Nito's uh, neutral. Those tilts almost sending him all the way back, but falls out of the down tilt just in time. Mm -hmm. Bear getting uh, Nito off stage. Shine throwing out all these aerials, trying to find a way uh, to keep Nito off stage. But oh, there's that up air. You gotta be careful about trying to land with your. Um, with your focus attack because that up air is two hits. Yeah, sure you can going through the platform and another option just approaches. Nito will be the first to close out a stock in game two, something he couldn't do in the entirety of game one. Oh, nice recovery coming in for Shine, but there's a focus countering out that bear. Went for the, didn't go for the heavy sure you can, and uh, nearly, it, it that weak hit looked really awkward. It did. Oh, there's the a focus, focus attack, goodbye. Got him with the medium, um, it's the medium jab into the heavy jab. Now the back air from Shine will send Ken almost too low to make it back with proper edge guarding. That Ooh, look at this end. damage. The back throw, Rage just so helping him out here. Already up to 50% with what looked like a pretty small combo to not two frame with the down tilt. Mm -hmm. Oh, trying to get him with the tomahawk grab, but Auto turning coming in handy for these Street Fighter characters just immediately got him with a down tilt and just confirmed out of it. Yeah, Nito just turning to Shine and say, You think you're the only one that can three stock me? I'm just going to return the favor. That matchup, as you said, so horrific for the Fox players. He is combo food. He is so light. He has such a fast fall speed. Mm -hmm. And those are just contributors to early deaths. 
Mm -hmm. Of course, this is, you know, a five-game set in winter semis, so plenty of games and plenty of opportunity. Is he going on? He's going on a phone. Is he going on a randomizer to determine his character? No. I, I've I've seen weirder things from Shine, believe me. He's been my roommate. He hasn't done that one yet. <laughs> no, he he just goes based off who he feels like he feels like playing. Fair enough. He's like, you know, th th this character sounds good. And then he throws, and then he loses the set, and then he loses his PR points. <laughs> that's that's, that's uh, Shine in a nutshell. And then he decides, okay... I lost the game. Now it's time to go one of my one of my four one of my five characters that are like PR level. And then he wins that game and then he's like, hey, you know what? That that was too much. Now I need to back it down a bit. And then yeah. he goes down to his tertiaries. I, I like Shine has levels, right? Like he has his tiers. His top three, definitely Donkey Kong, Lucas, and Pokemon Trainer. Mm -hmm. Then he drop a tier. That's when you go into the Bowser Jr. and like the like some of those weird characters. And then the fox is like when he feels like he wants to turn off his brain and he just wants to fight his opponent. Certainly. Where would Bowser land on that tier list, do you think? Uh, that's that's his tier two. Okay. The, 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 Bowser's definitely a tier two character. He's been playing this character for quite a bit. We did see Shine pull out this character earlier on stream. So, mm -hmm. again, not entirely unfamiliar and not entirely unwarmed up. but. Mm -hmm. Also, he saw Nito kind of struggle against the Bowser, and he's, tr I, I low-key think he's kind of taunting him right now. <laughs> he wanted to go for the shield break, but <laughs> the only thing that's breaking is Bowser's will to live at the moment after being hit with that short Ooh, Yuken. almost died. If uh, Nito went for the went for the ledge immediately after, he would have died. He would have got caught with that dare. But good jab combo into the Shuri Yuken, that upbeat putting in work for Nito. Mm -hmm. yeah, uh, Nito feels uh, a lot more comfortable in this matchup now. Ooh, almost died for that air dodge off stage. Parries though and goes to the landing up air. Oh. Up smash on top of the platform. Yep. No command grab right now. Just B reverses the fire breath as well. And there's this fair coming in. Now what is Nito gonna do to get himself off the ledge? Hit him apparently. That's gonna be the answer. That'll work. That is something you just do need to be aware of whenever you're facing a Ken. Try not to go for two frames. You know, it's so easy to just go off stage, go for an air, try and gimp them. The recovery isn't the best, especially with the jump gone, but it's so risky just standing on the ledge because that isn't necessarily your property. Mm-hmm. Oh, nice. Con That's an interesting confirm. I've never seen that one before. Oh, that was a risky uh, option. He's going to die for that one. Yeah, the command grab will absolutely eviscerate that second stock from Nito, he'll be playing in disadvantage. Nah, yeah, no, nah, he's currently in the advantage right now. Oh, didn't go for the heavy one. I think the heavy one might have killed him. I'm not 100% sure about that one, because Bowser is a big boy. He's living to 166, and that rage will be boosting some of these fares Ooh. and back airs. Goes oh. off stage, but does not clip with Ken. Oh, good night. the air dodge in, and that will do it. Nito, before things get out of hand, 60% down, but that's no problem for Ken Masters. Mm -hmm. Oh, there is some pressure coming in from Nito, getting 13%, but that's not completely true. Shine going to uh, counteract it with some pressure. I don't know how Shine is going to come back from this. He's going to throw him off stage. Ooh, went for the immediately, uh, immediate fair to kind of rob that stock. Descends with the dare and gets the back air. Now, Nito, it's an even percent game. Ooh, shoot. That could have been cool. All this damage coming in from Nito. Pressure. Even stock game, rather. Mm -hmm. um, it, it's going to take like a, at least like half a combo for Nito to come back, honestly. Oh, wait, he's been ahead. He's My, ahead. Bad. My bad. My bad. It's uh, all good. It's going to take like one grab for like <laughs> Bowser to come back. It's going to take one fair <laughs> off stage. He is. Oh, he got hit by the, by the Shoryuken yet again. I was about oh. to say he is in position for that, but the fair will take him right back to where he came from. If he comes from off stage. Oh, that's not where you want to be. Oh, the forward smash caught him. Couple of feet from Bowser. Those that's those are those size 25s coming in. The third different character will do the trick for Sheena. He's up to one in this best of five set. Winner semis. Yeah, it's gonna be. Been looking. Uh, it was it was looking a little rough for Sheena, and then he 
kind of turned up the pace a bit. I didn't even. I don't even like remember when he just decided, like when he started like to be ahead in that matchup. That is, you know, such a mentality thing for Shine, though. It's as if he has just this switch in his head. This, like, I'm gonna play now. I'm gonna start tr not trying necessarily. We're gonna say the Diddy Kong, the fourth different character of this set. I don't envy the people who are coming up with the YouTube title here, but. <laughs> Nah. Diddy Kong was his favorite character in Smash 4 to use against um, what he considered scrubs. <laughs> because uh, he felt like he could press any button, get these ledge cancels, and then just keep the pressure going just like that. Of course, one thing that you do have to be aware of from Shinya's perspective, Diddy Kong's shield is a lot smaller than the likes of perhaps Bowser or Donkey Kong. So when Ken is going for some of these on-stage combos, these will be doing enormous amounts of shield pressure, just something you have to be eternally aware of. Ooh, getting the grab. Uh, another thing you need to be aware of is that Diddy Kong's a fast faller, so he still is pretty much combo food, and that's going to kill him. That DI out, not going to help him out this much. Yeah, Shine just not quite showing the PR prowess he displayed in games one and three. <laughs> oh, Get, getting him right there with that banana, uh, counteracting the grab. This is a ledge pressure situation. Oh, getting the read. Yeah, excellent roll read with the F smash, just reversing that, but unable to kill across the stage. Oh, and now this rage absolutely adding to that Shoryuken as every hit connects. Man, that 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 Shoryuken was so powerful. I I low key thought it was gonna kill like at <laughs> sub kind of fifty percent. <laughs> the F smash and a little shrug mm. from Diddy Kong. Another one. Shine just playing with his food now. Oh, he went for the hell out of here. That's a taunt to get bodied within a couple of seconds. <laughs> Shine just in a bit of trouble now. Might want to think twice before throwing out another just unworthy shrug. Well, he's probably thinking, like, the banana's still in play. I can still get it. It is, but... Yeah. Yeah. Bear coming in. Oh, that... That slow Hadouken from Nito was really smart because if Shine went for the up B like at that moment and hit him, he was dead. He would have died immediately. He would have just dropped his death. It is, but good recognition to avoid that. Does not convert off of the banana for a long combo. Uses the side B as a movement option. Mm-hmm. Oh, catching the banana with the down tilt. This is where Nito wants to be. And Shine not looking so hot right now. He's more than likely going to lose this game. Yeah, There's I'm death. Fine. Sure, you can see uh, that third stock just gone in an instant. Gone with the, just the dirtiest of sure you on top of the platform. Yeah, just hitting him with that DP. Just didn't want. He said, I'm going to end this game right here. And now, and now we're going into the last game. Let's see what Shine is going to go. Are we going to see the full Shine? Five different characters. And we might just be seeing Donkey Kong this time. Yep, and here's his, uh, probably his one of his best characters. Right. This is one of the characters he's known for, Donkey Kong. Trying to, especially since uh, Nito did not ban PS2, and that's why Shine is going this round, uh, going uh, Donkey Kong for his last game. Game five of Winter Semis. Ignore the scoreboard. We'll have that fixed in a moment. Back to PS2. Do you like the stage choice for Shine and for Nito? Oh, no, no, not at all. Like, this stage is Donkey Kong's best stage ever. Like, this is where he knows all this, the Ding Dong confirms. If uh, Nito gets over to 60%, 50, 55%, he's going to die. Side B comes in from Nito this time. Oh. He's in a slight percent lead, but no longer after that dash attack. Don't get grabbed. Oh. Oh, is that the ding dong percent? Oh no, he he messed it up. He messed it up. He went. He accidentally fourth threw his up through. Not gonna kill just there. And now this is this is where Nito needs to capitalize because he's out of the ding dong percent. And now uh, Shine needs to find a different type of confirm to close out the stock. He can't really close it out with a grab for a little while. And there's the DP coming in from uh, Nito. Yeah, excellent. Sure, you can just at the ledge. So returning immediately to the ledge if he missed, unpunishable but didn't even need to go for the punish. You cannot punish when you're in the blast zone. No. Yeah, and now Shine fishing for a grab. Missed out on that dare, and Nito just 
racking up all this percentage. Oh, he only got one hit of the dare of the down B. And Nito's running away with this lead. Yeah, I believe this would be Nito's first PR win of this third quarter. So even you know with his plethora, plethora of impressive victories previously, that forward throw not enough, but that time it will do it. Mm -hmm. With his plethora of impressive victories, not a single PR win on his resume this time. This would be the first. There's the up throw. Get as much damage as possible. Didn't get go for a true confirm, though. This is with the F tilt. Uh, he's looking for a grab. Wants up throw, dong. up air. Not Gets gonna be it. Dong, but doesn't kill. He missed it up just Focuses a little bit. It. He didn't. He didn't let go of Nito before he landed on the platform. So he, Nito didn't go as high as he should have. And now Shine is down to his final stock. 99% and has to close this out before things get too ugly. Yeah, but it's not looking good for Nito. Like him being stuck on this ledge is really detrimental because Donkey Kong's bear pressure is insane. Oh, didn't get the neutral get up. Here Nito is back. Very smart. Oh my gosh. Not going to work out. Nito's running away with this lead. He needs to too. Oh. Oh, no jab lock. Gets rid of the DK punch, but no, not gonna kill just yet. Climbing up, needs to close out a stock and then get another one early, perhaps a spike, but misses with the dare or the dash attack rather. Crosses him up though, so avoids perhaps catastrophe. <laughs> yep, on the ledge. Oh, he's off stage, but he got hit, so he's not gonna get hit. Oh, no DP coming in there. Shine the still needs to close out the stock. Just burying those fireballs away. And waits it out perfectly spaced, going to throw him off stage cargo grab. This is not undoable. Yeah, he messed up his confirm right there. This certainly isn't impossible with this rage fueled A. Oh, good night. That's the end of the game. Sure, you can under the platform. We'll close it out for Nito. Gets his first PR win of the third quarter. And a hard fought one at that. Just had to adapt on the fly to so many of Shine's different characters. His bag of tricks just ran empty at the wrong time. Mm -hmm.